A soldier's smile is a great way to donate to the veterans of this great United States that have put their lives on the line so that we can be free. And there's just not enough coming from government to cover all the need that these veterans have. Many of them don't have the kind of money that it would take to do the kind of reconstruction that they're left needing. So it's an opportunity for you to donate to these folks that badly need your dollars and help us help them. Basically, put your money where your mouth is. Okay. Open for me again, please, Ron. So I'm here with Dr. Gregory Sawyer, who is one of the doctors, dentist, that is part of our Soldier Smile program. As a matter of fact, the first patient of Soldier Smile was done right here in your office to serve. Thank you so much for being a part of this. Thank you so much for the opportunity. Why would you, a prominent dentist, decide to do something like this? Well, I will admit, to, you inspired me, Montel. Oh. When I heard in, in Phoenix when you talked about this program and realized how much need there was, I wanted a way to give back to our community. And these soldiers really need the help. It's been so rewarding in the first two I'm working on. We just finished one today. The one that you finished today was a really kind of a, a tough case, right? Yeah, yeah, he was Tell tough. Tell a little bit about it. Well, he, he had a, a, a cleft palate, a congenital uh, defect, so that uh, after he's lost his teeth, the bone on one side and the other side don't communicate. They don't touch in any way, and we made him a denture. Next will be implant support for it, and it'll actually help those bones from moving. Well, and then the other case that you did today is this gentleman, Ron, 75 years old, and he doesn't get his teeth fixed he can't have valve surgery for his heart. So this is really life-saving dentistry. That's right. His uh, cardiologist sent him here and said we need to get his teeth fixed so he can have this uh, life-saving surgery. But Doc, this is one of these programs where somebody would say, well, send him to the VA hospital. They'll try to fix it. Why would you get involved in this yourself? Well, I'm not sure that the VA hospital can fix everybody that needs to be fixed. I mean, that's, that's what it comes down to. And this man needs to be helped soon, and there's probably waiting lists mm -hmm. at, the, at the VA hospitals, and we need to get to him um, so we can have the surgery that he needs. Thank you so much. Sir, for what you're, you're welcome. Absolutely. And thank you so much, Montel, thank for you. doing this for them. Thank you. It's all about a soldier's smile. George, you have got to be excited today, are you not? Yes, I'm very and excited. tell everybody why. I just got my new partial and I haven't had a upper for almost two years now. And you've been walking around doing what? Eating without them? Yeah. Chewing around them? Chewing around them and, and it's very, it was very difficult to uh, eat certain foods. Mm -hmm. Now I'm able to uh, enjoy a hamburger. If there wasn't a Soldier Smile program, would you be able to afford this? No. It was a godsend. What would you say to another dentist who was considering volunteering to do this? I, you know, I'd just say do it. You know, I mean, these are people who put their, their selves on the line, and not just themselves, but also their families, uh, you know, for us. So, you know, why not give back?